Oh no. Oh no, we're losing speed so fast. The mindset that sometimes people bring bad things to themselves. This is going to be a perfect example of that because I'm going to take this three cylinder piece of shit all the way to Canada. And you know who's going to stop me? Nobody except for myself. So, catch us on the side of the road later tonight. We're headed to Eau Claire on our first part of the trip. It should be great. Uh, we'll catch you when we break down. We have just made it past Madison. It is very hot. Uh, we almost got ran off the road by a semi already, so it's off to a great start. We are about an hour and a half in, I'd say. Probably two-ish hours left, probably a little bit more since we're in the Geo. Um, if anything eventful happens, we'll keep you posted, but right now we're, we're looking okay. We have yet to die, so we get a pass. decided to take a stop at ye old rest stop because we had to pee. The Geo is doing great. It has yet to blow up or blow a tire, so two hours left. So let's see if she holds up. Michaela and I have made it to Eau Claire in the Geo. We are getting our McDonald's now. Uh, dinner of champions but this is more like a very early breakfast at this point because it's taken us so long to get here uh, we're gonna eat our food go to sleep and hit the road again tomorrow morning we'll see you then it is the next morning we are loading up the geo for our second day of adventure hopefully we make it the rest of the way but there's only one way to find out so let's put the top down and hit the road. I've been on the coast. I've been on the coast. Think about the most. We don't really care. We don't really care. I've been on the coast. Tell them how to do it on my own time. We don't follow road signs. I'm gonna get a bag and we push them. All right, that is a big hill, and we are in a very small car that has trouble with hills. I'm gonna need the power of Christ for this one. What we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna go as fast as we can, and hopefully we'll lose as little speed as possible going up this hill. Okay, come on, baby. Oh no. Oh no, we're losing speed so fast. Oh my god, I might have to actually downshift. We're going 55 now. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on. We're almost there. So close. I can feel it! This is what victory feels like. That was successful. We've made it up the hill. I don't think I had it. 
couple of deals with the devil, but I broke. And now we throw the way the GPS before we go. Can't be scared of jump, that's the only way to know. I've been on the coast. I have made it to the coast. We've made it. And the geo has not broken down. We have faith. Always. Scarface, no, you got the whole world, even in a cold world. Hey, take the ice and wear it on you. Let it drip so anyone who ever died it catch the flu. Yeah, it might fall apart around you. Pick them up because most of the time you know you got back from our little walk by the lake. And we're going to put the top down on the Geo and go to our room. We have made it to our room. Geo is chilling outside, doing great. We've got absolutely no cell service here or Wi Fi. So we are going to enjoy the outdoors a bit and then go in town later for dinner. But that's about it. It is day two on Lake Superior. It'll focus. Uh, we just got back from breakfast. Uh, Geo performed great this morning as it has in the past. So we are gonna go hit some hiking trails and see what the day has for us. We got back from our hike not too long ago and something exciting has happened since we've been back. So there's this couple that we've been talking to that's been sitting in these chairs out here with us and we are riding in a brand new Audi A6 to dinner tonight because the Geo is a charmer as am I. So here's what we're riding into dinner. How do I get in these situations? I don't know. Last weekend I was stranded on the side of the road in Mauston. This weekend, I'm eating steak at a German steakhouse and riding in a brand new Audi A6. Things happen. Sometimes things just happen, bud. Kayla and I just got back from dinner uh, in the Audi. It was amazing. We had a great time. And look at that view. Endless water. There's an abandoned building behind us. <laughs> yeah, charred building behind us. Uh, anyway, it's been great. Tomorrow we're going to head home. So hopefully that all goes well. Uh, we're going to cash out for the night. You guys have a good one. It is our last day and the day of our return journey. 
We're gonna go grab some breakfast and a sweatshirt from a souvenir shop and we're going to see if the Geo has the same strength at that on the way up here. Wish us luck and I'm excited for the journey. very quickly. Uh, we made it past Duluth. Uh, we're back in Wisconsin. We're pretty close to Eau Claire. It's very loud. It's very, 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 very hot. And this car does not have AC. I'm not even wearing socks or shoes right now. Uh, the Geo's taking it like a, like a champ. Temp gauge hasn't moved. We're at gas. Nine bucks the last fill up. I'm worried about me surviving more than the car at this point. We are both a mess. We're sweaty. We're burnt to a crisp. A semi is passing us. We're tired. We're sweaty again. We're an hour and a half out from home. Kinda just wanna get there and jump in the pool and cool off. The Geo's holding up, strong as ever. Only a little bit longer to go. Last leg. Bill and I look disgusting. We smell disgusting. But the fact of the matter is, the Geo looks just as beautiful as when we left a couple days ago. This outperformed any car in its class. We drove to Canada for $30 in the Geo Metro. And that is not a joke. I'm not overestimating. It was 30 bucks to take this car over 10 hours to Canada. Don't know many other cars on the road that can do that. Thanks for joining us for this episode of Midterm Motors. Catch us next time.